morning guys welcome back for another vlog with me all right like i promised last week we are near wilson's prom a national park in the very southeast southern tip of australia i think it's the most south you can actually get in like the main body of australia besides tasmania i am with my friends kate and brendan but we are actually staying in like this kind of half trailer, half home. It's it's really cool actually, I wanna show you guys. So, it's actually like, there's a trailer right here, but they build on like a full room on the side. And it's really cozy in here. It, it feels like I'm in like an apartment or something. So it's super cold here right now. I slept actually right back here. It was fairly warm throughout the night just because my sleeping bag and blanket kept me warm, but as soon as we woke up, we just like layer up. Kate's in her pajama onesie that's it's warm, Kit. It's super warm. We're just getting ready here quick. Had a little breakfast, feeling good. It's gonna be such an awesome day out in nature. Wilson's Prom is the number one place I wanted to go to coming to Australia. Ah, I'm so excited. We're going hiking today. We'll probably end up on a beach or two. Let's head to Wilson's Prom. All right, Kate, here we go. Let's go. Let's go hiking. You. Frozen? Like your soul? Oh, there's cow pies all over the ground. It's not Kate, bad. did you diarrhea? Remember last time? Last That's time we were walking through this, um, we're just walking and then randomly a yeah, kangaroo just walked time. straight in front of us. Like literally like right here. We are officially in Wilson's prom. So this is our first of three hikes for the day. Brendonian. Yep, first the wildlife walk. So it's like a little 30 minute hike. We're gonna hopefully see some kangaroos. And there's actually ostriches here, guys. And if you, or emus, I was gonna say, if you don't know what an emu is, it's like an ostrich, basically. <laughs> guys, we spotted our first wildlife. We're going off trail here in Australia. <laughs> no way. Where did he come from? Oh my god. We are deep in the bush. <laughs> Where did he come from? Guys, look how close we are to all these kangaroos. They just keep popping out of the grass. There they go. We are seriously just walking closer and closer into this group of kangaroos. Oh my god, it's just got its head in its, it's, got its, head in its belly. <laughs> Should we walk farther out, Kit? Yeah. Oh, you're okay, mate. You're okay. There is a wombat right here. I have never seen one of these before. This is the cutest thing ever. Hey, Mr. Wombat. We're sneaking in on the incredibly cute wombat. Mr. Wombat, we're your friends. We are so close. Oh my God. I feel like I'm on National Geographic. <laughs> and I'm Coyote Peterson. I don't know what else he says, but we are out here in the brave wilderness. Guys, look at the claws on him. He's not afraid at all to come close to us. He's gotten comfortable. Bye, Mr. Wombat. You're super cool, but you're freaking me out, man. Okay, what do you think of that right there? Did you think we'd get so close? No. That was so I cool. I didn't even think we were going to see that many animals. Oh, okay. Emu? Yeah. Kangaroo? Wow. Wombat. It's crazy how tame all these animals are out here. Should we go try get closer to the emus or no? It's a wild cat. Let's get close. <laughs> Me and my buddy. He looks a little diseased though. Let's go. Well, that was super cool, guys. We're back at the car. Honestly, walking into that hike, I never expected to see that much wildlife. It was so cool to get like up close and personal with some of those animals, and they seemed like really comfortable with it too. All right, on to the hike. So we stopped off to have a little snack before going on our hike. We're in a really cool area right now. It honestly is like a mix. Like look at these trees over here. It kind of reminds me of like the rainforest a little bit, but also like African vibes. 
Really, really cool area. What'd you prepare, Kit? It's um, kidney beans, diced tomato, capsicum, chili, and salt pepper. Right on a piece of bread? Mm hmm Mmm, that looks good. This is about the strangest sandwich I've ever had, but... Oh. Guys, the weather isn't looking too amazing at this point. There's been some darker clouds rolling in, but we're gonna go for it anyways. I think it's about an hour hike to the summit, and then hopefully we'll get a little bit of drone action going on. I'm excited to go out and hike. I wanna spend some energy, get the heart rate going. It's gonna feel really good. Kate, how long is this hike? To be honest. I think it says 3.8 kilometers over there. It says one hour, and I don't know. It might be two hours. Worth the views? Yes. Yeah. I think it'll, with our walking, it's probably gonna take three hours up and back. And when you say our walking, you mean your walking because last time we went hiking together was in Krabi in Thailand. Uh, the video, Thailand's most epic viewpoint. I'll link it right here or there. It's really cool to be out hiking again. This time in Australia at Wilson's Prom. It's gonna be some epic viewpoints. We might get to still. Wow, that sunset is popping. Guys, we just got down to the car park. We're gonna head back to the caravan. It was so windy up there. Couldn't fly the drone, Couldn't, could barely speak. We got a few photos, but yeah, we just hiked back down. We're pretty tired. It's, just, uh, it's been a fun day. So we've stopped quickly over at this beach called Squeaky Beach. And apparently the sand is so clean and fine here that it squeaks when you walk in it. Kate, make a squeak. That's pretty interesting. Oh. Squeaky Beach. Hope you guys don't mind my hair today, by the way. It's been pretty crazy. Didn't shower this morning before starting the day because we're just going hiking and stuff. But when we get back, I'm looking forward to a nice shower. I don't even know why I'm talking about that right now. Look at this. This beach is incredibly beautiful. And right over here, there's like these giant rocks. Guys, can you cut out the romance bullshit? Let's go on these rocks. Can we get up any of these? Yeah. Kate! Monkey! I wonder if I can climb up this with the camera in hand. Yeah. You think I can do this? Actually, this is a little bit of a commitment because if you don't make it, you slide down. Oh, holy shit. <laughs> I was like feeling myself fall backwards as I slowly crawled up. You guys made it. <laughs> holy shit. I told Kate I could for sure pull her up, but just like when I was going up, like I started kind of falling halfway. <laughs> uh, I think this is about as far as we can make it. Look how huge these boulders are behind us. That is crazy. Kate, how are we gonna get back down? I don't know. We're gonna have to jump. This, I'm tall, so I can easily step down this, Kate, but you're like five foot. No, I'm like, you're like on the edge, Jordan. Okay, here, get on my back. Ah, my feet. This is why you need big friends. <laughs> if you're a small little girl child. 
Guys, that is where we were just at when we hiked up to that viewpoint. So cool. I love hiking to a summit and like getting up there, seeing the amazing views, feeling accomplished about doing something pretty cool, something a little challenging, but then coming back down and being like, whoa, it really puts into perspective like how big the mountain was that you were on top of. <sighs> Life, man. Okay. We're headed back to the caravan now. We will see you guys there. Kapow! Guys, we made it back to the caravan. We're hanging out here, eating some supper. Pretty excited watching some Harry Potter. We're gonna eat, enjoy some food, watch some Harry Potter and relax. Right, Katie? Smash time. Well guys, I think I am going to end the vlog here. But anyways, for some reason today, I was feeling a little off my game with the vlog. I just, uh, I was lacking vlog confidence. I don't know why. Every once in a while, I just all of a sudden question almost everything I'm doing. And it makes me feel like it's gonna turn out really bad. But, uh, I think that's just because I'm feeling a little nervous. I know I'm gonna be stepping the vlog game up here, heading to Chile, Sydney first. And I know I'm gonna be putting out a lot more content. I think, I think I'm just afraid it's not gonna be good enough. And it's messing with me a little bit. I know I've got you guys' support and I'm so excited to be making more content and to be sharing it with all of you. I want to thank you guys for coming along today. It was so much fun. One more thing you guys could do for me is smash the like button on this video, subscribe, and we will catch you guys in Sydney. I'm actually going to film the journey to Sydney, I think, so I'll probably see you guys on the bus. I got a 12-hour bus ride to Sydney. But until then, we will catch you guys next time. Peace, guys. Pow! Kind of set up here. Oh shit. Don't mind me just vlogging my life. Okay. <laughs>